are at the European Astronaut Centre. This is where the astronauts come to train to go into space. We're here to see our astronaut friend, Samantha. Now, Samantha has asked for our help to do some special yoga poses that will help her in space. So let's go inside, see if we can find her and give her that help. Come on. Oh, wow. Look at this. It's the European Astronaut Centre. And look, up here is the whole International Space Station model. This is where Samantha is going to go for six months to live. How cool is that? So here we have a photo wall. Lots of photographs of all of the different astronauts. And I'm looking for Samantha. Where is Samantha? <gasps> There's Samantha, look. Where could she be? Let's go find her now. Hi. Hi. Come on in. Oh, thanks. I'm Jamie. What's your name and, and what do you do in here? Okay, I'm Andy and you are here in the Eurocom console. Oh. So what we do is we talk to the astronauts on orbit, on station right now, while they're doing their experiments. Oh. So if you look behind you on that screen, you can actually see live pictures from the station coming down. Wow. So they're actually up in space right now? Yeah, and that's live footage coming down right now from the space station. Oh, goodness me, yes, I can see an astronaut. What's the astronaut doing? Well, so that guy, I'm not sure, he's a NASA astronaut doing something with Houston right now, but we have an ESA experiment coming up and then they're going to be calling us shortly. And they're going to phone you, are they, from up there? Yeah, yeah, they're going to call down and then we're going to try to help them as best as we can to do their work. Oh, that's brilliant. Now, I have a question for you. Yes. Do you know where Samantha is? Samantha? Mm. Hmm. Well, she's not in here for sure. No. But um, she could be at the pool. The pool? OK. Which way's the pool? Out the door to your left. Great. Well, thanks, Andy. Good luck finding Lovely her. Lovely to meet you. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Right. Let's see if Samantha is in the pool. Good to see you. Good to see you. Now tell me, what's your name and what do you do so, in here? My name is Hervé Stevena. I'm French. I work for the European Space Agency. And here I'm the teacher for the astronauts to teach them how to spacewalk outside the space station. Wow, and that, that's amazing. I mean, how do, you, how do you do that? So you see the big mock-ups that we yes. have behind us here. Yes. So they are huge. This is a real huge. size. So these modules are put underwater so that they have the feeling of working on the space station. I see. So they have to practice being weightless in the swimming pool. Exactly. And, and this is really fun. It sounds really great fun. I'd love to have a go. Well, thank you very much, Hervé. Yeah, now, you're I have welcome. a question. Yeah. Do you know where Samantha is? Well, obviously, she's not underwater. We don't see any bubble. She's not in there. But I'm sure that she's now in the gym. And the this gym. is in this direction. OK, I'm going to go find her. Thanks so much, Hervé. Lovely to meet you. Yeah, say hello to her. I will. Bye. Bye. Let's see if she's down here. I wonder what goes on down this corridor. Hello. Hello, hello. come in. Oh, hello. Well, thank nice you. Nice to see you. You too. Now, tell me what's your name and what do you do in here? My name is Isabella. I'm a physiotherapist. A physiotherapist? What does a physiotherapist do with the astronauts? Well, we train them to become real, really strong before they are going into space. Or when they came back, we're doing some reconditioning with them. Oh, that sounds amazing. So what sort of work do you do in here with them? So we, for example, do some heavy weightlifting. Look around, we have a lot of fancy sport equipment in here. Goodness me, that sounds quite challenging, but I bet you give them quite a hard time in here to get them fit. Yeah. Well, for them, it's more hard work than for me. <laughs> Goodness me. Now, I have a question, Isabella. Yeah. Do you know where Samantha is? 
Well, I don't know exactly, but maybe you could look into the VR room. VR room? Yeah. Oh, that sounds cool. I'm going to go there then. <laughs> Thank course. you so much, Isabella. Bye. See you. Bye. Hello. 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 <laughs> What's your name and what do you do in here? My name's Chris. I create pretend places on the computer where our astronauts can go to learn about the International Space Station. They have to put on a special headset so that they can see the space station flying high above the Earth. Wow. I was there just now and I saw Samantha. I believe she's left a clue somewhere. I wonder if you're going to find the clue. Would you I like wonder. to try? I would love to go and have yeah, a look. Like How do I do it? Can we just pass it to you? Right then, everyone, look at this headset. I put it on and it takes me to the International Space Station where there might be a clue from Samantha to find out where she is. Come on, let's pop it on, see where it takes us. Ah, oh, wow, I'm going to step into the space. Here I am on the International Space Station. Let's have a look at this place. This is the cupola module. It looks pretty cool. I wonder what's going on in here. Can you see anything in there? Wow. Let's look at... Oh, oh, is that Samantha? Oh, hello, Samantha. Do you, are, are you really in... No, this is your clue. Samantha, tell us, where are you? Oh, look. It's Samantha and her clue. Let's have a read of what it says. To do that, we might have to turn a bit upside down. You can find me in the Columbus module. <gasps> that means we need to go to the Columbus module. OK, everyone, I think we need to take off this headset now. Thanks, Chris. That was awesome. Now, which way to the Columbus module? Out that way and you'll find it. Brilliant. Thanks, Chris. OK. May the force be with you. And with you. Oh, Samantha. Oh, look. Look. Columbus Space Laboratory Training Facility. She's going to be in here somewhere. Let's go find her. Come on. Where is she? Let's hope she's here. Hi, Samantha. Hey, Jamie. <laughs> oh, thanks. Wow, this is cool in here. What's this? It's good to see you. It's lovely to see you too. So what is this place? What do you do here? So this is a mock-up. It means that it looks exactly like a module like this looks on the space station. It's kind of like one of the rooms of our home up there at the space station. And we call it Columbus. Columbus. <laughs> and so do you, what do you do in here? You do a bunch of experiments. A lot of the equipment on, you see on the wall, but then in reality we also have some on the ceiling and in the floor. It's to do science experiments, you know, with, with plants and with fluids and with the human body, all kinds of stuff. Cool. <laughs> and will you be doing yoga in a space like this? Why not? Absolutely. Really? Oh, that's brilliant. Well, I think we should maybe try a little bit of yoga Shall now. Shall we do some yoga? Yes, there we go. Let's do some. <laughs> now, I think first we should try a Jedi warrior pose. A Jedi warrior pose. Well, you great. are a Jedi. I mean, let's face it. So let's take the pose. We step All one right. foot forwards and one foot back, keeping our toes pointed to the side and our front toes pointing forwards. And then we bend into our front knee, keeping our knee in line with our ankle, Stretch our arms out nice and wide. Look over our front hand like we're Jedi warriors. And we can do anything in this pose. Wonderful. Now as we stretch up nice and tall, straighten that front leg, twist to the front, turning our other toes round to the other side and bending down into our front knee, stretching those arms wide, dropping the shoulders down, dropping the chin a little as we look over our front hand. Fabulous. And then coming all the way back up to stand and walking your feet all the way in. Lovely. All right. <laughs> Shall we try? <laughs> the eagle has landed pose. We have to do that. Yeah. Come on. So we turn to the front and we cross one leg over the other and use your toe for a bit of balance and bend into your knees. Yeah, like you're an eagle just getting settled in your nest. Take your arms out in front of you. Scissor your arms one under the other. Wave with your underneath arm. Hi. 
and then twizzle them around each other if you can to see if you can find, yes, find your palms and sit down a little bit lower, squeezing thighs together like we're little happy eagles sitting in our nests. Ah, ah, the eagle has landed. Indeed, <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> Creating that lovely resistance and then come all the way back up again, unraveling our arms and our legs. Well, I'm just really curious to see how you get on with doing this. And I mean, the weightlessness is one challenge, but whether it actually does help you feel that lovely calmness, that mobility, that extra stretch and strength in your body. Yeah, I, I can't wait to try. It'll be exciting. I'm looking forward. Yes, me too. Well, thank you so much for having thank us, you. Samantha. And best of luck on your mission. Thank you, thank you. And namaste. And namaste. Thank you. Thank you so much, Jenny. Bye. Bye. <laughs> wow. What an amazing day we've had here at the European Astronaut Centre. We have learned so much about how this place works. And not only that, we found Samantha and we did some yoga together. Wasn't that fun? I can't wait to see how she gets on with her yoga in space. Well, I've had an awesome day today and I hope you have too. And I hope to see you again soon. Namaste. Namaste.